So this young man just came up, and what were you saying Dude, about Sophie? The bearing on this is fucking killer, bro. <laughs> killer. Rock and roll, man. Thanks. Yeah, she's uh, love it. Man. She's a one, one of a kind. You don't see that every day, man. Right. Peace, man. Yeah, man. Be safe. Thank you. What's up, peeps? I'm out here with uh, my buddy Volts. We're at, um, what is this, Volts? Uh, Old Glory Harley. Old Glory Harley Davidson over in Maryland. And uh, we're just checking stuff out. We're actually gonna shoot a walk around of Volts's new 2020 Lowrider S. And while we were walking around, we found something that, uh, Wow, brought back a lot of good memories. Let's go check it out. So Volts, when did you uh, when did you trade in Martha? November 2020. November 2020. Got a really good deal on his Lowrider S. We were out here checking uh, checking out the used bikes and look who we found. Martha. Dude, shoot a video. Dude, shoot the video. That sounds amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, check out Martha, man. Does that bring back some good memories, Volts? Yeah. Wow. And if you're looking for a heritage, you need to get out to Old Glory because this is probably the best heritage that anybody's got on the market right now. Custom, uh, custom fender. Yeah. Oh, that's right. That's right. I remember I picked that fender up for you from the paint guy. Yeah. You only had that like a month, right? Yeah. Bronze uh, upper upper rockers. Well, this this shield alone is a lot of money. It's yeah. the uh, the lowrider S one. It's the bronze one. Man, we had a lot of fun, man, bronze, with Martha. Uh, bronze or I don't know what the, the name of the color is, but this is bronzed out. Uh, push rod covers. Push rod covers and the top of covers too. Yeah, wow. He's, oh, he's Martha. Also, uh, from a Slim, I believe. Or from a Deluxe. It's oh, not right. the uh, regular heritage. Yeah. yeah, like I said, if you're in the market for a heritage, do get out to Old Glory because this is the most tricked out heritage on the market. And uh, she's amazing. Well, I think we should go take a look at your Lowrider S, man. All right. How you doing? Looking good. I'm all right. Thanks, man. Living the dream. I'm telling you, every day, every camera. day. Yeah, it's a dash cam right there. That's the dash cam? Yeah. Okay, okay. For liability purposes. There you go, okay. So, Volts, you want to take the camera and uh, do a little walk around on your 2020 Lowrider S? Sure. What do, do you want me to tell about Just all the whatever parts? Whatever you want to say about her. Everybody wants to know about her. Talking to the mic back in the oh, back. Yeah, so the, well, if you start from the front, I added these little pieces here for the brake caliper. It just covers, you stick them on. My camera for, you know, for insurance purposes. It's a um, empty shade uh, Road Warrior. The 11 inch, um, what is it, slotted? Windscreen, slotted windscreen. Slotted windscreen, yeah. Uh, I have Wolo, is it the the brand Wolo Horn? Mm -hmm. uh, that was ten bucks. That's that's actually probably that, the the best. That horn yeah, is really loud, the best man. upgrade, the, the cheapest upgrade for the money. Uh, this is the high uh, bunking crash bar. Is the high because it actually accepts um, forward controls. Mm. With the low one, you cannot put forward controls. With this one, you can. You go to the front mm. Yeah. Um, these are the bronze collection pegs that I had to install with an adapter. So the new mates have a different system to install the pegs. It has, uh, they actually swivel back. They don't do this. This is from the Dynas and the Sportsters. So you have to get an adapter to make it fit. It's actually a lot slimmer than the new mates, the, the old ones. Uh, timer cover from the brass collection. Uh, what else from here? Uh, the, oh. Shut down or shut off. What's that? No, just touch the screen a little. Oh, there you go. Um, the knee pads for the tank. 
time. That's for when you're going 130 miles an hour and you can squeeze your legs on that <laughs> thing on, right? Yes. Uh, this is for the heated, heated gear. I have to tuck it better. Saddleman seat because you can't you can't have a lowrider S without a saddleman seat. Apparently you're you're throwing off the club or something. Um, then uh, these are these are new. These are the SW Motec uh, LH bags. They're actually asymmetrical. If this one's smaller because it goes right over the pipes. Speaking of the pipes, these are S and S um, slush cuts. These are really cool. And they, they have a quiet baffle right now. I also have the um, rear axle brass cover on both sides. Don't mind the temporary Wait, plate. Show them the awesome custom Maryland expired tags on there, man. Yeah, yeah, this is <laughs> it's good until it's good until uh, January 2023. Sure. Yeah. Uh, it's lovely Motec bags. This one is bigger because of the because of the left side doesn't have the the exhaust. Um, the pegs. These are the bunking passenger pegs, which are actually crash bars. The only problem with this is that it won't cover your bags yeah. if it goes down. But it will protect a lot of the frame. Um, I don't know what this is called. Whatever cover this is, uh, I need to replace these. It's, it's this is an almost brand new bike, so it should be okay for the next 5,000 miles. This is Korean yakking. Um, is this called whatever cover? What is this cover called? What cover? The this sandpaper? One. No, this one. The coil cover. Yeah. There you go. Coil, coil cover. The peg for the shifter. And what else? Oh, this is something Harley did mess up. This one fits here, but you cannot fit the actual gas tank on the Lowrider S. It won't fit. This collection won't fit in this Crazy. bike on the blacked out rims. Uh, the bars, these are four inch risers from Drag Specialties. These are 75 bucks. This is pretty cheap. That only it's took us like what nine hours over two yeah, days to yeah, put those riders 75 on. Seventy-five bucks. <laughs> um, the headlight for it to work is the fly eye headlight, but this is pretty, pretty tiny. It needs to have its own bucket. So that bucket is from Moons, I believe. Um, and, it, and it for it to be waterproof. That's it. Just show the oh, headlight. Oh. The headlight and also the cover for the radiator. And then the Volts also put a lot of sandpaper all over the bike, so that gives you just a little bit of drag to keep the bike down while you're going yeah. really fast. I did that on the oh the CC bar. I didn't talk about the CC bar. This is an Eddie Ricci, I believe, from Etsy. I'll just put some paper here. This destroys the oh, when I'm carrying beers, it destroys the box. <laughs> so I'm not gonna I need to remove it for to put my backpack. That's it. That it? think so. Well, it's a nice looking bike, man. We've had a lot of fun working on it a little bit here and there. As you can see, he's done quite a bit of uh, mods to it. I bought it here, by the way. Yeah, he did buy that here at Old Glory. And like I said, if you are in the market for a heritage, the best heritage ever is right over there. And I'm sure they'll give you a good deal on it. And I guarantee you, no one has ever modded a heritage as much as Volt's modded Martha. I miss you, Martha. Or old Martha. So anyway, that's it, guys. That's it for today. We actually hit some pretty nice roads coming out, but my friggin' uh, helmet cam bricked on me, so you can't see it, but we can. We had a great time. See you later. Peace.